Hey America, it's me, Citizen Kate, and I'm here at the Republican National Convention at a protest called March for Our Lives. And you'll notice that there are cops surrounding us. There's like a whole line of cops on bicycles over here. They're really cute in their uniforms. And there's cops in like dark cars and cops you can't really see. There's probably cops in the outhouses. This is going to be great. So much fun. For the war, still nothing for the poor. That's not right. There should be billions for the poor as well. Any more? What tips do you have for me since this is my first official protest at the RNC? Um, oh, let's see here. Uh, um, that's good. When are you going to start playing? Uh, I think in 15 or 20 minutes. Okay, God, you know what? Protests are a lot of fun. I don't know what everybody's complaining about. It seems pretty peaceful to me. I probably didn't wear the best shoes to march in. What does a citizen do to protect themselves and their First Amendment rights? Well, unfortunately, during uh, political conventions, we find what we almost call a suspension of the Constitution. Suspend the Constitution? By cordoning off places, surrounding them by police, and then arresting individuals without probable cause. Um, that is what we call a suspension of our First Amendment right. Oh, my God. Could they arrest me right now? If you're dressed in a patriotic outfit, you're probably safe. Oh, really? So if you wear red, white, and blue to one of these things, you're not going to get arrested? If you look like the American flag, it may help. They're after what they call the so-called anarchists dressed in black. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Note to self, if you're going to come to a political protest, wear the colors of the American flag or just wear the American flag. Oh, can I dance with them? Wrong. 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 Are you guys protesting apples and bananas? We're working There's with special police. Your friend in the blue. Oh, you're working with the police? And we're trying with the police guy right We're there. trying to help them find all the naughty, naughty protesters. Oh, can I help you with that? I don't, I don't know what's happening exactly, but what's going on? Um, it looks like maybe they're uh, snatching somebody up, and I'm encouraging people to not be susceptible to their tactics of trying to divide the crowd. This is a diversion. Do you know what's happening here? A couple people got arrested. Oh my god, there's like a huge line of them. They're like a human wall. Maybe the police are just bored with our mellow rally and they've decided that they want to provoke a situation with us. Oh my god, they just arrested that girl. Let her go! Let her go! We're having a stand down here with horses. And it's weird because I think that the police are actually surrounded by people. I wonder how they feel being on the other side. Nobody's being violent. This is not where you want to have a front row seat. They're pointing guns at us. And Mace, do you see that? We might get tear gas. They gotta be protected. Protesters, when they're attacked by cops <laughs> with uh, elements like tear gas, they use uh, vinegar to protect it from going through the rest of the tour. That's incredible because apple vinegar is also really good. Oh, there they go. It's also good for losing weight, apple vinegar. Oh, yeah? Is yeah, it? it is. This is as close as we're gonna get to the inside of this detention center. Fortunately for me, I wore red, white, and blue. My producer looked like an anarchist. I don't know where she is right now. There's a bar here named Pig's Eye, right by where the cops hang out. Coincidence? 